Good morning, Girl with MS here on a very June gloom sort of Southern California morning. Um, it's actually July, but I'll take it. I'll take this June gloom. Um, it's actually been really pleasant the last few days, which is nice. And as you know, with MS, the heat can be quite intolerable. And we've got a, a heat wave coming, so it's going to be pretty warm. But I'm going to enjoy this for now. So how are we doing today and this week? Um, one thing that I want to focus on today, one of my intentions, it has been all, all year, but uh, something that, that really comes to mind is the power of the words we use, the words we choose to use. Um, just something very simple. Think about if we're always using the word need. I need this as opposed to, I want this, um, I need to do this. Do you need to do it or do you get to do it because you're alive, not six feet under? So if it's something you get to do, you, you know, it's like, let's find the positive in absolutely everything we do and let's think about it when we talk with our, use our words. Um, I do this, been, practicing this for many months and it's taking a long, long time. But, uh, you know, I'll talk about work. Like, I've, uh, oh, I've got to do this. Um, I need to do this. I have to do it. And those sort of words are actually a bit negative and they bring it down and they cast a negative shadow over what we're about to do as opposed to saying, look what I get to do. Look what I've been blessed with, this opportunity to do this. Let me do it. And just taking that simple little twist in attitude, but applying it to everything we do. Literally start applying it to everything you do. I have to make my bed. I get to make my bed. I have a beautiful place I get to sleep. I'm going to make my bed so that when I come back here tonight, it's going to be a nice, serene place for me to fall asleep. <clears throat> I know it sounds very Pollyanna and rose-colored glasses, but start thinking about the words you're using and start making a change. Start using the words like, I get to, I would love to, when can we? Um, start really thinking of the positive twist on everything you're using and see how after a month, see how that awareness, if that changes anything in your life. I'm really curious to find out, but we'll come back around to that in, uh, in about a month and we'll see how everybody's doing. Um, but I thank you for joining me on this Girl with MS. Nice and cool here. Uh, nice, short and sweet. I made some beautiful Moroccan tea, Moroccan mint tea. It's a green tea mint blend and I just I love it I love herbal teas but I like having this little green tea in me it just uh, feels also soothing I've read so many good things about it so that's what I'm doing uh, and one of my efforts to be kind today I'm going to uh, watch my words and I get to do a bunch of fun stuff today a lot of fun projects some people might call it work or chores. Uh, I'm calling them projects. How can I do it? Uh, have fun and move on. So that's, that's where we're at. Okay. Good to talk with you guys. I'm looking forward to hearing about, uh, about how your awareness might change on this. And we'll talk more. Okay. Take that, MS. Bye.